I'll show you how we actually develop a homestead food forest. It's very simple. It's, it's not changing the whole nature's uh, way of growing things. Already this area wild, some plants are growing. In between that, what we are doing is we are, we are, we are incorporating the food crops. Like this is a yam crop. Uh, in Hindi, we call it arbi. So this is growing. This is a mango ginger plant. So which we have planted haphazardly, no planning. This is a king chili plant. See, this is a king chili plant, uh, which is growing here. And this is the same. The same till we call it till in Hindi. So the same is growing. Some castor plants are coming by itself. So so we can have some silkworms also. And this is arahar. So this is uh, we have planted the arahar, king chilies, yams, and even even in this herbs you can see. I'll show you something very important which I noticed. Right, this this this. See, uh, this is we planted this yam which which uh, actually we cultivate. We we plant them. Right, this is very good for the tuber also and also for the leaves which you can eat but here nature is giving us a very beautiful yam this is uh, very colorful and if i can ask antanu to bring the camera close and 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 show them so this this uh, yam will grow and this is also very nutritious and, and it has got so much of immunity building properties but we are not planting this nature is also gifting me when i am not destroying the nature i'm keeping it together i showed you these are arahar plants and again i'll show you here come see here here uh, this is a uh, gourd. It's not bitter like it. It, it, it uh, in in as means we call it bhat kerala. So this is uh, something coming out of the seed bombs. Uh, I will be talking about the seed bombs. We make seed bombs and we throw it uh, when when it is raining and it is coming out. This is a bitter gourd coming up, right? So these are all seed bombs. So this is bitter gourd. Uh, this is again that gourd uh, which is very nutritious. Come on, I'll show you something more. So see, I cannot step, yeah? These are, these are all bitter goats and they're coming up. They're, they're, it is only we planted, we, we have just thrown some seeds and see how these are coming up, right? So I'll take you this side, come. Uh, now these goat plants are growing. So we have planted some papaya, right? Local variety of papaya. And see, come here. See, this is whole. What we did is we just took seeds of roselle and just threw it here and now these all roselle plants are growing these are all roselle plants growing right so this is how and uh, to the border i was talking about the lemon trees i told you about the lemon trees papaya again those gourd seed bombs growing and then you can see the yams come 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 run 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 santanu has to run with me so see these are again, uh, these are again turmeric uh, coming up, turmeric plants, uh, the best quality turmeric with high curcumin percentage, some areca nuts. And this is again one tuber crop which is very nutritious, we call it kathalu. Uh, this is, uh, we have tapiocas, come, see already the growth of the turmeric plant, so it's, it's not. For them who are confused about that we have to remove other trees to grow food crops, it is not like that, the growth, even if the insects and other things are coming, they can resist, right? So this is a beautiful way of growing, which I have learned from nature. So come here, come here, come here. I know Santanu is scared of uh, moving with me for the snakes with the camera. Again, I'm coming to the turmeric part. Then here, you can see the Thai corianders. Thai corianders, we just planted the Thai corianders, now they have produced seeds and this will disperse and this whole area will come into Thai coriander part, right? So see, see this, this come, come beautiful, see this is beautiful, this is whole Thai coriander we planted and now this whole area, they are, they are producing seeds and they will grow, so same growing, we need uh, grasses for the cows. So the, we, we are not thinking about only us, it's compassionate, right? So for the cow also we have the crops. Uh, this is again black stem. This is again black stem yam, which is very nutritious. And if you have some cut and bleeding also, it, if, you, if you put the sap, it will stop the bleeding. King chili, see the growth. Many people think about those aphids attack and white fly attack, but here in the when it is mixed and planted like this, these are very good. Come, I'll show you another beautiful crop and which is, I think, the most nutritious crop. Do you know what this is? These are all sweet potatoes. These are all sweet potatoes. This is a jungle of sweet potatoes with some goats, cucumber, everything coming together. 
So the whole process is to just mix seeds, throw it, plant it, make a jungle of immunity building local food. You cannot do it with the hybrids and the modified things. So grow food, learning from the book, which is nature. Let's mimic nature, how it grows the jungle. We grow our food and grow very beautiful immunity building strong food for you.